This race is probably the most important race of the year. This is what the fans come out to see. It's what puts them in the stands. So it makes them pay their admission to come see the best in the world race their cars and put it all on the line. I've been racing RC cars since before I was born. My mom used to put the controller up against her tummy and had me work the throttle and maybe a little bit of some turning for her. I was, I, I knew from a young age that I was destined to be the greatest RC driver of all time. Green flag drops, you head off the bridge. First corner is a left, big sweeping left-hander all the way around. Drops in under the bridge. Right hand turn, over the step up. The first off camber right. Once you go over that, you hit a nice jump. Lips built up really big on it, gotta be careful. Hit the right hand berm into the little tabletop. Once you clear the tabletop and set up perfect for the right hander. Come out of the right hander, if you have enough speed on the outside, you'll triple the uh, whoops. And if you don't hit that just right, you'll stuff into the third whoop and that could be a day ender right there. The bridge is part of the track that'll make or break you. If you can hit that perfect, you're you're making up time on everybody, but if you hit it wrong, you're left into the tires, you have a broken arm. I'm gonna win the two water Parker 4.25. There's no question. No one else can stand, even step up to what I have. Cartman, he's going right into the wall. Mike Wilson's gonna get stuck. Jason Voss is gonna take himself right out of this like he did the backyard challenge. Art's not even gonna show up. This car's still broken too. It really is. There's pictures. If you think you have what it takes to step up to the plate and take on the likes of me and really think you have a chance on winning, you're out of control. Perfect.